In this tutorial, let me show you how I made this creative PowerPoint slide. So if you want to be an expert, watch the video till the end. Let's begin the topic. Here I have already taken a blank slide. Go to insert, go to shape, pick a rounded corner rectangle shape and drag it over here like this. Rotate it, increase the size and place it here like this. Go to shape format, go to format shape go to gradient fill and select a gradient color from here and you may adjust the gradient from this stops very easily let me click on this let me insert another color and this is looking beautiful go to shape outline make it white outline go to wide and increase the white three point go to shape format go to shadow click on offset center now let me click on this make it duplicates place it here go to gradient fill select another gradient like this now again click on this press ctrl d to duplicate and place it here like this select this one go to picture or texture fill go to insert select a picture from your computer let me select this picture and uncheck rotate with shape and this is looking beautiful now again go to insert shape pick a rectangle shape drag it over here go to shape fill select this fill color shape outline make it no outline rotate it place it here go to insert shape text box and right here creative powerpoint slide select it change the font increase the font size and place it like this now go to insert go to shape pick a line shape hold down the shift key drag it over here go to shape outline wide and change it to four point now let me select all of this place it here now i have to add some animation select this one go to animation click on fly in effect option from top increase the duration click on here go to effect option increase the smooth into one second then let me select this one go to animation painter click on this one effect option from right and this one will be after previous then select this one animation painter click on this one effect option from bottom and this one also will be after previous then let me click on this go to animation painter click on this one effect option from left this one also will be after previous and select this one animation painter click on the text box and click on this go to animation painter click on this now here let me watch the slideshow this is perfect so hope you found this video helpful if you like this video please share this video with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.